everybody, this is Brick Boy HD back to you with another video. Today I will be reviewing the new 2018 Lego DC Superheroes Speed Force Freeze Pursuit. It's ages 6 to 12, has 271 pieces, and it's set 76098. Comes with four minifigures, the Flash, Cyborg, Killer Frost, and Reverse Flash. So let's start off with the many figures. Let's move all the others out of the way and start off with the Flash. So the Flash is kind of like the ones we've gotten before, except he has like a new torso print. He has like cool lightning on his torso. If you can see it, the camera's not picking it up very well. There it is. Sorry if my hands are a little shaky. So, there's the front print and the back print of his torso. I think he actually has a new face print too. There's that, and then he has a big smile on the other face that doesn't look too normal, so I like to keep it on this and plain uh, le red legs and no arm printing. So that's basically it for the Flash. Now let's get on to a really cool new figure that is really long overdue, Reverse Flash. So this is Reverse Flash. He has uh, the old Flash helmet, but in yellow with the red kind of like uh lightning bolt things on the ears so we'll take that off then he has a face print oh, let me see if it will focus focus there it is so he has kind of angry face then he's got a really angry face open teeth uh angry face and it looks a little weird with the mask on so i like to keep it on this face then he has the cool lightning bolt backwards than the flash and then he has the red belt and the yellow suit plain yellow legs and no arm printing there's the back of his torso so now we got a new cyborg minifigure uh, same uh, helmet and head print as the one from the Justice League Flying Fox set, which I didn't uh, uh, get because it's way overpriced. But uh, some cool torso printing, silver arms with no printing on it, no leg printing, but just silver legs. Really cool front torso printing. Then there's some back torso printing too. And there's the face. Has an angry one. And a smiling one. So. That is basically it for Cyborg. Then we have. Killer Frost. That looks kind of weird in my opinion. I think Lego could have done better. I wish it was kind of more like the TV series Killer Frost. The hair is really my big problem with it. I think they should have gave, given her, like, Scarlet Witch's hair or uh, the Lois Lane hair piece for, from the Heroes of Justice Sky High Battle set from Batman vs. Superman. It's the same hair piece, but I think it would have done really good as in white. But there's that. Uh, and then she has a plain blue face with a really angry face. And then she has like an, uh, a happy face, kind of. No printing on the arms, just plain blue. Then some cool printing on the front of the torso and the back. And then there's really no printing on the legs at all. So put her back together. And she comes with some cool accessories, which I'll show you uh, later. But now let's get on with this vehicle that's 
looks a little weird and kind of looks like it should be coming out of a junior set but it's still kind of cool uh once again i think lego could have done better but it's got like this cool ice scraper piece with this sticker here then there's a place to seat uh killer frost if you uh raise your arms all the way up and then move her legs you can sit her down kind of lean her back a little then move her arms down a little and then it has this cool one of these cool new pieces of shooting out ice then it's got the double stud shooter like so but we've all seen that before they just kind of flew around my room so that's nice i'll be nice trying to find them later then it's got another piece that kind of looks like this one but it's actually a bit smaller so there's that and there's a bunch of new pieces which i'll show you later too then she's got this like ice or water tank like if like a car was following her she could like dump it into the road and throw off her enemy that's following her and that is basically it for this vehicle there's not much to it like i said it kind of looks like something out of a junior set but let's move on to the cyborg's helicopter which looks really cool and it can the propeller can spin and the cool thing if you like i'll use reverse flash for instance you can there's a little uh trigger right back here and you can just like flick that and it should shoot out it doesn't really do well of like folding out but the idea of it is supposed to catch the villain so that's kind of a cool feature but yeah there's that and the netting is a cool circle piece or circle shape in red so that's really cool i'll move that out of the way and cyborg can come in here and just uh, you gotta move his arms up and push his legs forward a little then lean him back then his arms can go forward and you can put him in so some cool stickers back here right along here and here and this helicopter actually kind of reminds me of the uh wolverine chopper showdown from like 2012 i think which is a set i wish i would have gotten but didn't but uh you and the cool thing is you can actually take a cyborg and you can take this and uh this off and you can like put it in his hands kind of so like have him holding that as like some blasters so that's pretty cool and they just clip onto the helicopter so that's really cool. I'll move that out of the way. And there's a sticker there for the control panel. That's on the outside for some reason. And I think this is like a microphone piece. I could be wrong, but it kind of looks like one. But uh, there's the inside of the cockpit. But that is basically it for the helicopter. And I... So, uh, earlier I told you I'd show you guys some of the cool, uh, things that, uh, new pieces that came with this, and it comes with a bunch of cool new pieces, like, there's this big one right here that can be put in her hand, it's like a cool shield piece, then I showed you the, that, and, uh, 
and this on the vehicle. Then there's a smaller kind of like shield piece. Then it, these, they've also got these like ice rods kind of thing that have like a spiral on the side as you can see there so those are cool and you actually get two of those and then there's these pieces that kind of look like uh power blasters but they're not because they don't like shoot you can try but it doesn't do anything as you see but there's those so there's all those really cool pieces there and then the flash comes with two of these i'm just gonna use one to demonstrate and it's us these are the power blast piece pieces and you can just kind of shoot it Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. You kind of have to put the edge of your fingernail on the side, then just shoot it. Uh, if you put your whole finger on there, it won't, like, shoot well. But there's that. And then this set also comes with one of these, like, I think they're called uh, power infusers or something like that. And all three of the sets in this line... It comes with one of these. This one happens to be blue. There, I think there's also a green one and a red one. And uh, so you can have reverse flash and flash like uh, chasing each other for it. I'm not sure what it's kind of supposed to do, but it's there. So that's pretty cool. So let me just set everything back up and... I'll close out this review. Oh. I might have to like bend a Killer Frost and Cyborg back a little so they'll stand with their weapons. And so, let me adjust the camera a bit. There's that, and then that. So, that was the Speed Force Freeze Pursuit. It's a new 2018 set. Uh, just came out today, but I was able to order it on ToysRS.com a little early. And so that was cool before they actually took all of them down, I guess, because apparently they weren't supposed to be selling them. I don't know, but I think they're now back up since the regular release date is January 1st, and that is... The time, the day of the recording of this video should be the day that's uploading on to. But, so yeah, that is the new uh, cool 2018 set. And it is $30, so pretty good price point. And, and that's price point in the U.S. I don't really know the prices in like the UK and stuff but uh, look out for my reviews of the Lex Luthor mech takedown and the Lobo space bike set so I will be reviewing both of those hopefully soon and that is it for this video uh, please like comment and subscribe for new videos make sure to click the little bell by the subscribe button so you'll always get notified and i'll see you guys next time bye